Yeah, and one of those events is really important for the city of Dripping Springs, one of the fastest growing towns here in Central Texas. We're talking about the annual Founders Day Festival going on right now, even this late. Juan Rodriguez joins us now live from Dripping. Juan, is anybody out there tonight? You know what, Chris? So many people have been out here all day. In fact, hundreds of kids are still waiting to get on some of these rides. I did speak to organizers who say about 5,000 people are taking part in this festival. In Dripping Springs, Tillman Bellotto tries his luck at carnival games. It's really fun. Um, there's a lot of fun games. He's joined by thousands of others soaking in the good food and fun at Founders Day, the biggest festival in Dripping all year. Are you my next contestant? Come on down! It like brings everybody together. You run into people that you've seen since they were little. Katrina Bass has been coming here for nearly a decade. It's celebrating this town being founded and becoming a community. When the Moss, Wallace, and Pound families first moved in, from three families to thousands, dripping has grown a lot over the years. And seeing faces that you recognize, you know, or the parents that you recognize. And it's like, oh, hey, I know you. Hey, how's it going? Or the new people that you get to meet because they're new to the community. A not so small town honoring their roots. Buena, buena, buena. Giving those like Tillman the opportunity to enjoy what Dripping Springs has to offer. If you come out, remember to have fun. Remember that this is about community and, and celebrating what Dripping Springs is. So the festival doesn't end until midnight. You still have just a little bit more time. Now tomorrow the rides will come up again at noon and they will go on until 5 o'clock. According to you live from Dripping Springs, Juan Rodriguez, KB News.